Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we are playing some City Skylines. We played some of this uh, recently on the channel, don't worry if you missed it, it doesn't really matter. Ow! Let me just fill you in on where we're at. I inherited this town, well this country, from the last president, past Kevin. Always hated that guy. And I know what you're thinking. You're looking at this and going like, I, I can see why. This is awful what he's left you with. But no, this isn't even what I'm worried about. This is a minor issue. This is the big issue. <laughs> this is the elephant in the room. This is a tsunami that came in from all the meteors that we launched on Sewage City. Well, the useless part of Sewage City. This is just where the people lived. Over here is where all the industry is and where we pump all the poop and whatnot. And the graveyard, of course. That's very important to our society. Anyway, I guess we just gotta wait and see what the tsunami does to Dublin. I would hope we've all evacuated to the top of the spire so we'll be safe. Look at them all just driving around like nothing is happening. Uh, are they not seeing this? Am I the only one seeing this? Oh, there's more meteors. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I was focusing on the wave. There's a few different natural disasters going on right now. Well, natural disasters that I'm trying to keep an eye on. Look, we can see them both from here. <laughs> you see the mushroom cloud in the distance. If you look the other way, the tsunami's coming. Oh, the Coast Guard's warning. You're a little bit late. It's like the Coast Guard knocking on your door. There's a tsunami over your house. This guy's still determined to drive through. <laughs> oh no, he's not driving through. <laughs> bye bye. Oh, sweet Jesus. You know what? You're actually lucky that I'm incompetent and you don't have power because electricity and water are mortal enemies. Just like me and water or me and electricity or me and me. Should I just fast forward this? I feel like I'm just prolonging my misery here as it slowly washes over the city I worked so hard on. There's a flood in your city. Don't worry, water will evaporate with time. Thoroughly flooded buildings are abandoned but can be rebuilt if there's the Man. Oh, okay, that sounds fine then. Let's just fast forward through these issues. Oh, that doesn't look good. I'm sure the spire will be fine at least though. You know what? Let's get demolishing. What's what's the point in focusing on the negative here? Look, they're happy. <laughs> I don't know why, but they're happy. Take caution and avoid- Wait, what? Oh, you're talking about the tsunami still. It's the same one. Don't be panicking people thinking that there's two. That would be ridiculous. I've heard bad things come in threes, but knowing this city, bad things come in like 30 because they got hit by about 30 meteors. Take caution and avoid- Are you still talking about the same one? Uh, one can only hope that it'll tire itself out before it gets to Sewer Town. Maybe I could like build a trench, is that possible? Might be no harm anyway to separate Ireland and Northern Ireland. I know from history that it's a bad idea <laughs> to let them mingle. Canal, a shallow canal. This is expensive. I want something cheap. Like I want to solve my problem, but I don't want to spend any money doing it. I've built a little trench and I've realized that this might be kind of hopeless to be honest. I'll just see what happens to play. I'm going back to demolishing buildings again. I will fix Dublin to get to the real goal of getting to Cork and building a utopia. That's gonna be the utopia of Ireland as it is in real life. Checking on the tsunami. No, still going. Okay, back to demolishing houses. <sighs> really, I have to wait for the fire to burn out before I can demolish it? <sighs> Politics. Oh God, what, what is this? Is there someone dead in there? Get rid of it. Get rid of the body. Put it put it in the cement like the mob would do. Oh God, <laughs> I'm the government and I'm trying to mimic what the mob does. Why isn't the local government doing anything to stop the fires? I tried, but they won't let me send the bulldozers in. Oh, there's someone sick there. Get rid of that. Someone sick there. Someone sick there. Get out of my city, sick people. I thought I'd banned you already. <laughs> I wrote some legislation that just says that sick people cannot live here. You get sick, we destroy your house. There we go. Oh, I destroyed all of them. How's the tsunami going? See, it burnt itself out. It didn't even reach the flood boundaries that I, I made. Look, it wasn't going to get past this anyway, so it doesn't really even matter. Oh, wait, no, it's still coming. Hold on. Hold on. It's still on the road. Oh, it's a hot dog, man. Okay, uh, when you look at it like this, it looks like it's on fire. And I was impressed that it was managing to be on fire while also driving through a tsunami. Look at how eager they are to get to my city. This is how good the city is. A tsunami has struck the city. What? Are you all about the same one? You really really just aren't getting that this tsunami is the same one. Wait, hold on a second. Why is the ocean overflowing? Why is this coming onto land? No, this isn't good at all. I've also just realized I think there's no actual way of leaving the city. So you're just stuck here with all the natural disasters. <laughs> like you you can't get on this road, I don't think. This is a feckin' death crossing. Oh wait, they can get on from here. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, he went right through him. Who should I call if no one shows up to pick up the dead? Ghostbusters. The 
those were the original lyrics i believe okay yeah there's a second tsunami coming at least this one's smaller <laughs> i guess i'm just gonna ignore it for now and we'll see what ha what happens but the problem is if this water all goes into poop lake the sewer city is gonna be overrun with poop <laughs> who could have seen it coming <laughs> <laughs> i don't think we have enough power install more of these fans ah there we go my biggest fan i think my only fan in this city actually good thing we don't hold uh, elections or have any sort of democracy in my ireland i uh, look the wave just died out by itself see these things just have a way of working themselves out pipes problem do we have a pipes problem oh for feck's sake you've built too far from the city no water for you <laughs> you don't deserve water honestly even the fact he's asking for water is kind of pissing me off because they've been complaining that there's too much water with the tsunamis and now they're like oh i want more water make up your mind please oh wait it's giving me warnings about health care yeah a lot of people are getting sick i should probably build another graveyard there we go now our capacity is not an issue die away people look how happy they are yes <laughs> they're complaining my crossroads are causing congestion look at this road there's literally no reason for it people are going down here it's just a wrong turn <laughs> they're going back up immediately again maybe i should get rid of it there's literally no no reason at all for this road there we go now traffic is flowing and everyone's leaving a breakneck speed i don't blame them everyone's getting very sick in this area of the map i don't know why that could be happening you know i just i've no idea why this could be happening to my beloved people there's a rising demand now all right sewer city you're about to get an expansion of more industry i can't think of a better place to put all that pollution wait no not a road jesus i don't want to spoil them there we go dirt road i think i could make a little offshoot here like they have power i could just build industry up here in sewer town this could be the home of industry Industry. Two lane, one way, small industry road. That sounds great. You're gonna come out this way. You're gonna go back that way and you're gonna connect back to the road. Like, look at this graveyard complaining about water. We just had a tsunami and it is lashing rain. And finally, why do you even need water? You're a graveyard. What are you doing? The good news is a lot more people are moving into Dublin. I guess they're thinking a tsunami doesn't strike the same place twice. Let's just hope they're right. <laughs> no one is building anything to do with industry here. And I'm really disappointed because i invested a lot of money here they're, they're literally using it as a way to turn that is it a, a very long way of turning around waterworks just told people not to drink the water no ig ignore them listen to me your president dictator whatever you want to call me i don't just listen to me or else i got plenty of funds to build another graveyard we got plenty of power to power up here i think because this used to support a lot more houses <laughs> which it's not supporting anymore so we can reroute it to here oh god there's a demand for residential everyone wants to live here there's also a demand for power Power. People want to survive, funnily enough. Why is everyone pissed off here? Oh, yeah, because of the power issue. Hold on. I'll sort it out. There's got to be a better way. Like, I don't care about pollution or anything. Power output 40, 20. I guess it depends on the wind. Hmm. Why is God against me in this game? And between the tsunamis... I was going to say the meteors, but no, that was me. <laughs> the tsunamis and the power outages be due to low wind. He just has it out for me. Okay, I'm going to have to have like a coal plant up here where they can get plenty of coal in and out. Also, they need water. Luckily, they got plenty here. Uh, hold on. Let me build the coal first. I don't want to build it right in their city because I, I need it to power Dublin. So I'm going to build it like a little down the highway. That should be fine. I hope this works because I've already built the coal plant, I think, and I messed it up. Yeah, look at it. There it is. Wait, could I? I have moved that oh, i could have moved that god damn it okay we have two coal buildings now god that lake is really filling up with poop fast you guys are impressive <laughs> oh wait no i forgot i'm actually pumping both cities sewage to this i forgot i spent tens of thousands rerouting the sewage from dublin all the way up there Ah, worth it. There we go. The coal is pumping pollution into our atmosphere. Huzzah, everyone. <laughs> Huzzah, we've done it. Look, the population's expanding. We're making money. Great idea. Low happiness. <sighs> what do you want? Entertainment low? Make your own entertainment. No libraries, no parks, no unique buildings. <laughs> Damn it, you guys are picky. Like, you chose to live here. You knew there was nothing here, but yet you still came. Unique buildings. What can we build? Eiffel Tower. We already have the Spire. Why would you want the Eiffel Tower when you got this bad boy? <laughs> Meteorite pack. This seems a bit insensitive. <laughs> Putting it right next to this place. It's next to the graveyard. <laughs> this is so bad. Have you noticed there's an abandoned building? I have, just because there's so freaking many of them. People keep abandoning the city, and I don't know why. Well, I, I have a few inkling 
feelings that, <laughs> that it might be the reason, but uh, they haven't specifically told me what one it is. Like, there's many reasons. All right, I'm making the city a bit more dense. I know what you're thinking. Dublin. <laughs> How could you make that place more dense? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Please don't unsubscribe. Wait, oh no, I just demolished that building because they had no water. That's not really their fault. <laughs> Oh, well, uh, well, like I said earlier, shouldn't have built there. There we go. It's, it, oh, it, there we go. It's de-zoned. Now you can't build there again. Gotta protect people from their own stupidity. Oh, God, I disconnected the power lines. We have so much prime real estate here, but yet they still insist on building over here closer to the sewage. Speaking of which, that lake's almost full. That's good to see. That's gonna be an interesting one. I'm not really sure if this can go above capacity. Like, if I keep pumping sewage in there, will it rise above it? Because that's a bit Concerning, if so, we might be able to make a little outflow to the ocean, I guess. Leave it uh, be a worldwide problem instead of just a nationwide problem. At least then some other people might pitch in and help. By which I mean do everything, because I, I don't plan on doing anything to stop this problem. I'm just going to wait and see what happens. Oh my god, I can build my road to Cork. It'll cost me 33 grand, but I can build a road to Cork. I think I'm going to do it. Am I going to do it? I I'm Yes, it's done. We've built a road to Cork, everyone. Oh, imagine how much it's going to cost me to pump all the sewage back up the sewage town. <laughs> I'd have to take out a loan. <laughs> How much would it actually cost me to, to pump it all the way? Oh my god, it's gonna cost me 17 grand. You know what? It's a requirement. I need to pump all the sewage up there. It's built. Oh, this is such a big mistake. I like how I made a meteor monument, but I feel like I should have a sewage statue as well. What it would look like? I don't know. You know what? I'm glad I built two of them coal places earlier because I'm actually gonna reroute that. I'm gonna steal one and bring it to Cork. <laughs> The people in Dublin wake up just scratching their heads as their coal plant is literally just stolen in the dead of night. Yoink. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what is happening to my utopia? Where did this tsunami come from? Why? Why, why am I so cursed? Like, there's people sailing out there. There's no way that's, un uh, like, unsuitable waters. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Should I just... All right, this is happening. <laughs> oh, what a birth of a city. <laughs> Immediately as I start building it, a tsunami rolls by. God damn it. The Coast Guard is warning of a tsunami approaching the area. Yeah, thanks, Coast Guard. You're so wise and observant. All right, brace yourselves, Cork. Just leave it roll over you like a wave of relaxation and leave it continue on to Dublin. Even though I don't want Dublin destroyed either, we'll just wait till it's to Sewer Town, then we can relax a bit. Like, is this because of the meteors or is this just random? Because I don't feel like... Uh, this one is due to the meteors. Maybe the last one was. Maybe that was my fault. Like a slim chance. Oh, they're complaining they don't have water. Don't worry. Soon you'll have more than enough water. Trust me. <laughs> it's on the way. <laughs> they're like, oh, maybe this dictator isn't so bad after all. We're getting what we want. And then they turn around and see this. Okay, Cork, that was just a christening of your city. Don't worry. It's all over now. Forget about your neighbors. You hardly knew them. They just moved in. <laughs> That's no loss. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to build a round about for no goddamn reason. It's just, I, I want to express my Europeanness. 25,000? Okay, I don't want to express it that bad. <laughs> 7,600. That's more my style. Now that's a roundabout. Sorry, that's just for all the Americans watching, so you're, you're fully in the loop. This is a roundabout. <laughs> it goes to nowhere. It's a bit of a magic roundabout, but hey, we have a magic roundabout in Cork. We call it that way because I'm pretty sure no one knows how it works. God, the tsunami is like the gatekeeper to Cork. It's not actually allowing anyone get here. The water is slow slowly spreading out. Dublin might not get hit that hard. I'm giving Cork a bouncing castle. <laughs> right on the roundabout. <laughs> Is that just a public bouncing castle? How does that work? And why do you need electricity? Can we not just get a few people to band together and constantly blow it up? Oh no, they can't get the trucks here to actually power the place. A tsunami has struck the city. What? Oh, that's the same tsunami as earlier, right? Hold on, I'll check in with you. Asher, ah, sure, that's tiny. You call that a tsunami? That's barely a wave. Jesus, I'd hardly wave back at it. <laughs> All right, wind power coming in for Cork. Why are you complaining about sewage? Just pump it up north. <laughs> That's what we've been doing so far. Going all the way up there. God, you must have a hell of a pump. And then it goes all the way up here. And yeah, that's fine, isn't it? Oh, God. Oh, everything's backing up. People are actually dying from their toilets backing up. But yet, the residential demand is through the roof. Like, I want to live like that. Maybe it's just too much. Like, there's one pipe 
while holding all of this sewage, supporting like two and a half cities. <laughs> Sounds like a sitcom, except with more sewage than usual. Yeah, that seemed to fix the issue. I'm just sorry there was an issue at all, folks. Hold on, there's dead people here. I'll just demolish the buildings. They'll never know if we don't find the body. This has got to be the most inefficient way of building. I, well, I shouldn't really be saying it about this. I should be saying it about this. <laughs> the long roads to get all the way through Ireland. Why did they have to start me at the top? Oh my god, there's a fire in the industry area. Don't I have a fire truck somewhere? <laughs> I swear I built one somewhere. A firehouse. There we go. They're complaining the garbage is piled up. Maybe they can't pull out the fire truck because there's too much garbage in the way. Oh, all the fire engines are in use. I see. Ah, well, they'll get to it eventually. Look at this. Cork is going to have a medical center. Ooh. <laughs> la la la. <laughs> and a bus depot. Ooh. This really is utopia. Japanese gardens. That looks nice. I probably shouldn't spend all my money, actually. Right, we were going to build a Japanese these gardens but instead we're gonna go with the wait the carousel park is more expensive it's one carousel all right see here plaza with trees no i just give them a tree just just a single tree ah uh, here we go i got some stuff all right i'll just build you a stonehenge it's not as cool when you you know how it's made you know <laughs> with modern technology they just put a few rocks together and that's it i swear there's some siren vehicle that ambulance is just driving around constantly and it's driving me a bit mad it's going around the roundabout. All right, and just to ruin the Stonehenge, I put a little roundabout thing in the middle there. The merry-go-round, you know, you can have a little play on that. That's nice. Okay, now that I've neglected Dublin for like five minutes while I was working on Utopia Cork down there, it's fallen into disarray. Like, this is what happens without my supervision. Jesus, garbage is piling up everywhere. Ah, uh, there's no more room in the landfills. That explains why. Oh, that's what I need, an incineration plant. I'll save for that and hopefully get to a population of 9,000. <laughs> Then I can just burn all the trash and make energy from it. I don't know why there's smiley faces coming off of that house. There's skulls on it. Someone has died and someone is happy about it. All right, you know what? Build that Japanese gardens. Just anything to make them shut up. They're getting very moody with me for no reason. I like how Sewer Town is trying to talk to me over there. Like, have you noticed that I'm just off here in a utopia. I can't hear them. Yeah, and this is my idea of utopia. I mean, in comparison, it kind of is, even though there's still a lot of death. I feel like I need to build this police station. Otherwise, crime is going to get out of hand. The hospital was being robbed earlier. <laughs> like, uh, first of all, I don't know what you'd even rob from a hospital. <laughs> but second of all, what kind of monster robs a hospital? Now, all I need is a firehouse, and this place will actually be a utopia. I like how my version of utopia is just covering people's basic needs. <laughs> that is it. Oh, what a utopia. <laughs> All right, I think I'm pretty happy with that so far for today. But as is tradition, I know it's only happened once, but we got to end it with Sewer Town being targeted again. There we go. Poor Sewer Town. <laughs> it always has such a rough go of things. But we're going to end it there. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you want to see more. I'm totally down to continue your utopia. Oh, it's so nice having police. <laughs> anyway, hope you enjoyed. Thank you again. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye for now.